what is going on everybody and welcome back to the channel to another episode of until dawn i hope you guys are having a fantastic day i'm sorry i know this video came out late i've just been making content on so many other games i've been having a blast with every other game that i've been playing so far but i absolutely wanted to get back into this game and actually finish it because i did want to find out what happened after we left i think it was josh aside the barn and we last left off with Mike and Chris. Chris, the dude I can't fucking stand right now. But weirdly enough, I started liking Mike. I don't know. It's something about Mike. I feel like he's he's the jerk that didn't really like Jess and just wanted to smash. And then he turned into the guy that like really tried to avenge death. And I respect that. I totally respect that. So let's get back into it. We did find out it was Josh, the killer's Josh. It's crazy. How does it feel? He fooled my ass, I ain't gonna lie. Emotions that my sisters got to feel once, one year ago. Only, only guess what? They didn't get to laugh it off. No, 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 no. They're gone. Jessica's fucking dead. What? Did you hear me? Jessica is dead. And you were gonna fucking pay, you dick! What happened with Jess, Mike? I don't remember killing Jess. Jesus Christ. Oh, God. Oh, my God, Matt! Three hours until dawn, y'all. Do what the fuck is that? I told you he wasn't bad. I told you he wasn't bad. He didn't strike me as somebody bad, bro. I had a feeling. He felt like a... Like somebody who was like basically like trying to warn him or protect him about something. Because when he when he gave out his hand to Hannah and Beth, he was trying to save them. I had a feeling. All right, let's pop that shit. Yeah. Oh my god. All right, I'm, all right, let's go. Nah, well, I know we all saw that shit, right? Big ass motherfucking alien looking shit. Come on. Yeah, bro, those screeches do not sound normal, bro. I knew it, it looked like some alien. I don't know what that was, bro, but that should look like a fucking alien for real. Hmm. A fortune totem. You're gonna tell my fortune? Yes, daddy. Er? Why is my controller always dying when I play this game? Hmm. Holy shit. What is that? Sorry guys, my controller. Oh! What the fuck is that? What is that? Oh, I almost missed. What is that? Oh! That looked like some kind of fucking alien. 
Um, 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 um. Go right, go right, fuck it. Ah! Almost died. Oh my god. Yo, I almost died. Pull it, bitch! Yo, what was that? Dog, I'm shaking, I almost died. Holy shit! What? How could you be moving after that? I would have froze. Yo, bro, I almost, I almost moved. I almost moved. I ain't gonna hold you. Yeah, bitch! Light that bitch on fire. Light that bitch on fire. Good shit, M. Good shit, M. Good shit, M. Um, 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 we're gonna stay on, we're gonna stay on, we're gonna stay on, fuck it. No. Jump, Emily! Oh, my God. Oh, my God. You gotta run! No. Run! No. Oh! What is that? Oh! Oh my gosh, she got lucky. She's alive after that? But my ass bone would have been done. I would not have got up, bro. Her shoulder, fam, you fell on your ass. On that rock right there. Yo, what the fuck was that's an interesting five minutes. Holy shit, a lot has happened in five minutes. I, 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 I yo, what is going on? Emily, run, 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 run. I actually like Emily a lot. I'm not gonna lie. Crap, what now? Are you alright? I didn't think that I'd make it. You were screaming bloody murder. Okay? You look totally wrong. There was something. Where's Matt? Come sit down, sit down. Something wow. A monster in the Wait. Room. Concerned, confused. Um, are you, no, fuck if she's okay. What, what are what you are talking you about? A monster? I mean, I, I know. Out like there. what? Gosh, relax, it was Josh. It was all Josh. No, 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 no. Listen to we me. We got him tied up. He can't hurt Shut you. up, Hayden. For me and it wasn't human. Hold on. Confused what happened. Where's Matt? Let's see where's Matt. Hey, I want to hear what she Matt, says. Okay? I don't want to talk about that fucking sack of shit. Wow. Damn. He left me. He just fucking abandoned me when I was hanging off that goddamn tower. Well, to be real, you disrespected my man. I am mad at my choice. Fuck shaft. that. He was just gone. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What, what mine shaft? I, I was walking down there in the mines, and it was dark, and I found this pile, and there was Beth's head. Wait, what? That's head. I found oh it. Oh my god. What the fuck? Are you serious? Yes, I'm serious. I think they fell down there. Oh, Jesus Christ. But the worst part is I don't think... Where's Hannah's died, body? Like, from the fall? Not right away. Wait, what? What do you mean? I don't know. I feel like she was down there. Like, yeah, she wrote that note. For weeks when we were all up here looking for her. We had no idea. Jeez, that's horrible. Listen, in in the tower there was there was a radio and I, and I got through to someone, but then that was right when the tower collapsed. Em, you made it. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Here we go. We're trying to figure 
Star-crossed star lovers. Monster that was chasing her. She's all messed up, guys. Emily. Hey, Em. Whoa. What the fuck can that be? Josh. Jess. Um, fam. It's, it's probably the monster. I ain't gonna lie. Who is it? I wouldn't open the door. Just check it out. No, fuck no. You okay, see, man. this is what aggravates me. You what? don't check nothing out in a scary fucking situation. You don't check nothing out. You have a gun. Sit there and wait for them to come to you. You never go to the fucking sound. That's how they get your ass. I'll cover the door. Give me the pistol. Nah, we're gonna cover. You, you're okay. a bitch, mate, boy. I'm gonna open the door. You ready? Mm -hmm. you ready? Just do it already. Whoever it is is probably gone by now. I, unless you want me to take a gun. No, no, no. I think that's less good. You do the door. I got the gun. Hey, gone. The dude's standing right there in front of you, dickhead. All right, let's open the door now. Hold on there. Hold on there, mister. Freeze. Ah, oh, what? All right, all right. Just take it easy, Grandpa. Okay, everybody, just calm down. Now, just move over there. Go on, move. Let me say what I came to say. I'm here to tell you what you're up against being back on this mountain. Should never have returned. There's always I guardians in this world, bro. What happened last year? You mean with Hannah and Beth? Yeah, how could you know without being involved? Oh, we're responsible. You hold on to your horses. I don't take kindly to you kids coming up here to my mountain. Your mountain? Huh? I'm sure the Washingtons would be very surprised to hear that. <laughs> well, the mountain don't belong to me, it's true. But it don't belong to the Washingtons. This mountain belongs to the Wendigo. The Wendigo? What the fuck is that? An alien or some shit? Let's hear him out. Not like we have a choice. Now I'm only gonna tell you this once. It doesn't matter to me if you believe it or not. I got reasons I wanna get it off my chest. See? I told you. He's guilty as shit. Guilty as something. Shut, Shut up. up. Dickhead. There is a curse that dwells in these mountains. Should any man or woman resort to cannibalism in these woods, mm. the spirit of the Wendigo shall be unleashed. Oh, crap. So that's what that was? You're gonna need to find somewhere safe. The basement might be okay. Okay, get down there now, all of you, and wait. What? Why? For how long? Till dawn. Guys, I ran off and left Josh when I heard screaming. Where did you leave him? In the shed. Uh, your friend will already be dead. No. No, he can't be. We, we were just with him. A lot can happen quickly on this mountain. No. Right. What the fuck just happened in five minutes? Five minutes of me starting this video. I see some fucking crazy ass alien looking shit. I don't care. I'm going to get him. Right. Let him know. That's a human being, bro. I don't need your help. You going alone is suicide. Yeah, dumbass. Chris, you're like the last person to try to play try to play hero, bro. I mean, I ain't gonna lie, my man's about to take a bullet, but that's only because it was my choice. I'm a real one, you know what I'm saying? Huh? Well, I'm going to get Josh, aren't I? No, I'm going to get Josh. You're going to help me. Do you understand? Uh, yeah, I think so. You need so to I'm follow. guessing what, what gouged his eye was a fucking Wendigo? No, you don't. don't. What? <laughs> you know. Trust me, I know. Right. Hey. Bitch made boy. Come back safe. She is too fine for his ugly. Oh heck nah. Need to hurry, son. I, uh, she is too fire, bro, for him. See you soon. Chris ugly as shit. The fuck up out of here, Chris. Go do your job. So, so tell me, you gotta prove you gotta prove things. to me, bro. 
what's uh what, what, what's the guy i mean i'm kind of liking him now he bagged he bagged yeah. ashley he's about to take a bullet for her you know, that's my choice though but yeah so how many times do i have to shoot it with the shotgun before it's dead it doesn't die oh hell you be shooting it a long time right thing, that shit took fire no, fucking what else it took the Emily dropped rocks. She dropped rocks on that shit. It, it fucking just bounced up. Like, bro, that's crazy. Also, they're weak to fire. Fire is a powerful element. Well, what, what are these things like? I mean, are they just crazy unpredictable? Or, I mean, can you figure out what they're going to do? Some patterns, like any animal or human. Well, you mean like how? Like they've got schedules. Well, they only hunt at night. Oh. Why? I didn't ask. Any uh, pro Wendigo tips? Like if I rub garlic all over me, they won't be able to smell me or something? Oh, they'll still smell you. Anything like that? See you if you're standing still. Oh, that's fire. That's gonna be mad easy. Based on changes of movement in their field of vision. So if I don't move, I, I'm, I'm basically invisible. Yeah. Well, I wouldn't recommend testing it out unless you have no other choice. I hope Josh is not dead, bro. I'm not gonna lie. He's probably. Suffer from a lot of mental illness, but I don't think Josh is a killer, bro. He don't he doesn't strike me as one, dude. He doesn't. Even after all that bullshit he just did, he doesn't strike me as a killer. These things, uh, Wendigos are or, or were human. Do they they still have some aspect of humanity in them? Well, they retain certain things. I mean, is it really right to kill them? I mean, maybe they can be human. <laughs> They surrender human rights the moment they eat one another. There's no cure, there's no redemption. Oh, he's gone. We're too late. Shh. Quiet. Damn it. We gotta go. Right now. We gotta find Josh. He can still be out there. <laughs> First, the Wendigo. He'll render you immobile. And then he strips the skin off of your entire body. What the fuck? He keeps you alive and aware and feasts on your organs one piece at a time. Damn. So the launch then. Let's go now. It might still be near. Why are we walking? You're very quiet. I did not move. No way he fucking dies now after surviving that whole time. Ain't no way, right? Back the fuck up, bitch made boy. I guess Chris does know how to use a shotgun. Well, my guidance, of course, obviously. Bro, you better walk. <gasps> Yo, what is that? Why does it look like? What is that? Fuck that. Get that shit off me. He said fire weakens it, right? Walk! Run! Open the door! Ew! 
What is that? Oh my gosh, that shit looks oh ugly. God, it took you so long. It's not so good up there right now. Understatement of the night. Chris, where's the flamethrower guy? Uh, yeah, he, uh... He didn't make it? No. What happened? The thing, it uh, tore him apart. Right in front of me. Oh, God. All right, these are all the doors? Yeah. Are you sure? What are you looking for? Another way out. Mike, look, I really don't think that's a good idea. We should stay put right here until dawn. At least we're safe down here. Oh. Oh, yeah. until dawn. Well, Interesting. Wrapped up like a little present with a bow on top. That thing to tear us apart on Christmas morning. People will come for us in the morning. You don't sound so sure. That is what'll happen, right, Em? Yeah, I, I, I mean, right? Well, you can wait. Motherfuckers don't sound so sure. Mike, there's no key for the cable car. Josh. He's got to have it. Josh? One of his dirty little tricks. Great. Great. If that fucking thing got a hold of Josh, then... Yeah, you're yeah, fucked. I don't know, Mike. It's possible. What's possible? It may have taken him down to the mine. What? I saw some horrible stuff down there. I think it's where that thing lives, and... Huh. F. What? Fuck it. I'm gonna get that key right from that thing's goddamn bedroom, and then I'm gonna get us all the hell out of here. Good shit. Uh, now I'm see. I'm liking Mike a lot. I'm liking Mike. Like Mike really, Mike really took a really interesting turn for me. I don't know why, but the dude, like, I don't know. Some about Mike that I'm really liking. He's like becoming a hero. He's fearless. He's not scared of shit. I was down there. It's horrible. You were. Some of them survived, but like 15 of them didn't make it. I found these plans. They knew the mine was a death trap, but they let the miners keep working anyway. Michael, I'd like to maybe focus on how we're gonna get the fuck out of here, please. Damn, just, relax. It's weird how much crazy shit's gone on up here. What's weird is that there's a tunnel leading from the lodge to the sanatorium, see? That's how I got back here. I saw this when I was down there. That's where it lives. Um. Um, what is the, huh? What is that? Ash. Um, nah, actually, mad pretty. I ain't gonna lie. Nothing. It just it, it bit me and bit you. What bit you? The, the Wendigo. What? It's nothing, really. It's not a big deal. You okay? Shit. It doesn't hurt anymore, really. It's, it's not that bad. Am. If that thing bit you... I, I know what you're thinking, and I'm fine. Are you? Yes. Emily, at least let us check it out. Emily, if the Wendigo bit you, you could turn into one of those things. Oh, that's ridiculous. He said it was from eating each other. Remember, he said oh, that. Is that how it works? Yes. It happens. If it bit you, you're going to turn into one, and then you're going to turn on us. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Relax. You can't be down here with us. What? Mike. You got to go. Are you kidding me? You're putting us all in danger. Like hell I am! Emily, you can't stay here. Mike, just cool your head, okay? We don't know if it works like that. Maybe it's just a bite. Right. I've seen what these fuckers can do. And I don't want to say it again. What is this? Guys, what are you doing? Door's right here. I am letting you do this voluntarily. Oh no, you're just making yourself feel better about sending me to my death since you know there's a Wendigo out there ready to rip me to pieces like it did with... Okay, oh my god, will you just go? Go, get out of here! Oh wow, there's no loyalty. Well, okay, whoa, whoa, whoa. Mike, calm whoa, down. Whoa, man, this is wildin'. You're, you're gonna shoot me? <laughs> like me? This is the safe room, M. <laughs> Please. It is not safe as long as you're in it. Not for us. <laughs> No, I don't like her whimpering like that. That's not cool. I'm really sorry. I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it. I'm mm -mm. I'm not shooting her. I'm not gonna shoot her. Anything weird. You guys know what to do. Yeah. 
No one leave. Okay? It's not safe out there. I'll be back soon. Good shit. Whoa! Why are you not bringing the gun? You see? Oh, this is that hero shit that I hate, but that I also like. Only because he was a dick and then became a hero. But bro, you take the fucking gun. Take the gun and blast any fucking Wendigo you see. First of all, where's the fucking shotgun? Give the shotgun to my mans. Why do you still have it? I thought that, that he was going to help us. With a flamethrower, dude? Now we don't have a chance. No, but it just means we've got to be tough. We've got to do this on our own. Good shit, Hayden. Really? Let him know, penitentiary ear. He said that you got to eat another living being to to do the curse, right? I don't think it works like you got to bite somebody. I don't think it works that way. It's not some vampire shit or zombie shit. It doesn't feel that way. Hmm. Hmm, look at that. So, ah, exactly. I have been bitten, but I did not change. Boom, right there, written right there. The only way to eat the flesh off of another, there is no other way. That's the only way to become a Wendigo. I fucking knew it. You see? You have to pay attention to these little details. Um, oh, no, 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 what? no, no. What is it? What does it say? Nah, I actually deserve to get smacked for that. Nope. I want her. I want. I want her to fucking. I want M to really just suplex this bitch for that. Fuck that. The bites. It, I want her to feel stupid. It bites you. It's not infectious. It doesn't mm. do anything. No shit, Sherlock. Let me see uh, that. I'm sorry. What did you say? Um. So she'll be okay. It says what? Rocka shit, M. Rocka shit, M. Fine. Oh, fine. you feisty Michael China. Shot me. Is that she fine? Didn't shoot you. And this bitch almost let him. Hey, that's not fair. She was scared. I'm the one who's scared. I, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Emily. I didn't know what was going to happen. There's none of us know. There's no excuse. There's no excuse. Emily, like, please just try to understand. Understand the palm of my hand, bitch. Uh huh. Toma, puta. There we go. I'm sorry. Nah, yeah. Take your little ass to the corner, cause you got me mad too. You was about to get. You was about to get shorty killed for that. The fuck. Shh, shh, shh. My, my little spicy china over there, you know what I'm saying? Now. Chris, just stay there. Just stay in that room. You have not proven yourself to me Joshua, yet. Joshua, you should have listened to me. Because of your choices, people have died. Yep. I don't know which is worse, actively triggering events that lead to someone's death or passively allowing a tragedy to occur. Right. Because you couldn't lift a goddamn finger to help someone else. Selfish. Remember last year? Huh? How you left your poor sisters to die? You did nothing to help them. Paralyzed by your own self-centered fear while a real threat was closing in. No, it's all about you, Josh. It's always all about you. I feel so bad for Josh, man. Terribly wrong. And your friends, like your sisters, have deserted you. You're all alone. Can you feel how cold your loneliness has been? To be honest, like, it's never okay to take revenge, but I feel so bad for Josh, though, like, the, they were not real friends to, to Hannah, bro, they teased her, they made fun of her, that was not cool. Oh, but of course you did. They were your friends, you misled them, you lied to them, and you put them through a night of genuine horror. Fuck them. Let's hope that it's not too late for atonement. I feel that. That your friends, if they still are your friends, can save you from this terrible isolation. Woo! 
I don't want to go, go any further than that. This was a fantastic episode filled with fucking screams. Oh my gosh, this, this episode was downright scary as heck, man. Ah, uh, if you guys could give this video a thumbs up just for my scream alone, that'll be fantastic. Comment your favorite part and subscribe to the channel for more daily videos. You guys are fantastic. Again, thank you for tuning in. You guys are amazing. I love you. Make sure you drink lots of water and you guys have a fantastic, fantastic rest of your day. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.